hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm doing the meet the artist challenge and um, I've seen many other YouTube illustrators do this and I was like oh that looks like fun so I decided to tackle it myself now this really didn't turn out the way that I originally hoped it was taking way too long but you know um, I, I learned from the mistakes that I made in this video and I, I plan on doing another one sometime soon. So what I gathered from watching other YouTubers do this challenge is that you are supposed to list things that you like and dislike about yourself or just things that you like or dislike in general and to pretty much provide information and like facts about yourself so um i've decided to go with the same approach that this other youtuber i think her name is chris hong went with i'm not sure if that's her name i think that's her though where she listed 50 facts about herself while she you know created art in the background <laughs> So I think I'll go with that same approach. So here are 40 facts about me. Fact number one, I am a March born Pisces. Yes, I was born in March, March 4th to be exact. Fact number two, my favorite color is blue. Um, really anything baby blue, well anything blue, but baby blue and pastel blue and light blue are really my favorite of the blues. And also um, navy blue too. So, fact number three, I really like um, the primary color scheme, like the the yellow, the red, the, the blue, how they complement each other. And I really like the pink purple and blue combinations as well. Fact number four, I really love drawing peonies. I, I never know if I'm pronouncing it right. I don't think I've ever heard anybody pronounce peonies or peony. That's a, a flower. Um, yes, yeah, so I really love drawing peonies, chrysanthemums, lotus flowers, and roses. Those are my absolute fav favorite flowers to draw of all time. Fact number five, I really like drawing animals, especially birds and reptiles. And like my favorite birds to draw are like um, owls, hummingbirds, and like um, cartons and blue jays. And my favorite reptiles to draw are lizards and like turtles, sea turtles. Alright, fact number six. I really like drawing human skulls and animal skulls as well. Fact number seven, my favorite foods are avocados, pineapples, raw cashews, and cashew cheese. And I really, really love chips as well. Fact number eight, my favorite hobbies are drawing, reading, creating animations, and like riding bikes and just being in nature. Fact number nine, I am very interested in being like a very business savvy woman. There are a couple of businesses that I really want to get into or I'm in the process of getting into. Um, like number one is my illustration business. Um, I want to create illustrations for like playing cards, tarot cards, skateboards, prints, um, maybe backpacks, stuff like that. Another business I'm interested in getting in is um, the t-shirt business where I own my own clothing lines. I'm currently working on things like that. I have another YouTube channel for that. It's called Sun Disc Printing. I'll put the link in below and um, I'll be uploading videos to that channel really, really soon. And eventually, other two businesses that I want to get into are the animation business, like owning my own animation studio and my own graphic design studio. 
I mean, I know that sounds like a lot, and it absolutely is. But you know, I, I, I plan on focusing on uh, my illustration business and my t-shirt um, business first, and then I'll do the rest later. And like, I'm also interested into um, getting into real estate and like the stock market and stuff like that. And even um, I've been hearing things about like Shopify doing the the drop ship. Thing. I'm not sure <laughs> exactly but I want to learn more about that and you know just I, I just want to make money you know I want to live I want to I want to do more than live I want to thrive right so yeah fact number 10 um, I am a very well I'm, I'm not very I'm, I'm, I'm moderately active and I'm trying to become more active like I was when I was younger you know, because like I don't want to get fat and stagnant and have like all these um, diseases and just sitting up in the hospital paying for medical bills and taking pills. Like I don't want to do any of that. So I'm working on becoming more active. <laughs> um, fact number 11, this kind of goes along with me trying to become healthier too is uh, me becoming a new raw food vegan like I've been tr kind of trying to do this for a, a while even though like it's been a while since I eat meat it's been like nine years like I was like 20 well I'm not gonna get my age here we're not uh, <clears throat> but it's been a while since I've eaten meat so yeah, I'm trying to make that complete transition where I only eat fruits, vegetables, um, nuts, seeds, and like dark chocolate and stuff like that. Um, I'm really trying to make that transition before this year is over with. So yeah, fact number 12, I'm striving to grow my hair even longer than what it is right now. Like I'm natural. Meaning, um, I don't, I no longer relax my hair, you know, or put other chemicals in my hair to try to lay it flat or lay it down. It just grows, you know, very coily and curly or whatever. And my hair is very, very long at the moment, but I'm trying to get it longer and healthier. So, yeah. Fact number 13. I currently want to learn how to speak Spanish and Swahili. I really, really want to learn how to speak these two languages. And I, I don't know. Like I wanna pay for a tutor, but I wanna get the right tutor. Or if I could just find somebody, you know, like a friend that, that can speak Spanish fluently and can help me out, that'll be even better. Fact 14, I am kind of a loner. I really like to be alone, you know? I mean, I don't really have many friends. I have friends, but I don't really have many friends. Um, and I actually prefer it that way. I just like to be alone more so than anything. Um, not that I don't like people, not that I don't like to hang around people or, you know, converse every once in a while. It's just me, I really, I, I'm a self, person um a little on the introverted side and i don't know i don't know if that's a pisces trait or not but you know it's 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 my trait though <laughs> fact 15 i would like to travel across the world um um and i really plan on doing this sometime in the near near future i don't know i just think it'll be such an amazing experience to visit you know all different types of cultures and see you know kind of what the world has to offer and you know just to relax and you know not worry about having to work a nine to five and you know I want to be able to travel like um, I'm not sure if anybody who's watching this if y'all know who Mary Jane Fire Byron yeah Mary Jane Byron is She's a YouTuber and she travels all over the world. And right now she's currently in Japan, I think. 
and then I forget what she says she's going to move next but you know I would like to do something similar to that not just live in other places but you know just visit other places Act 16 the first time I've ever been to a concert was this year actually March 24th uh, it was a Sunday and it was the Millennium Tour and I had so much fun oh my god I love B2K I love Lloyd Mario the Yin Yang twins Bobby Valentino I mean pretty Ricky just everybody Chingy everybody I had like the best time and I was sitting in the second row from the stage oh my god you can see everybody clearly clearly I had so much fun me and my sister went so yeah and we were thinking about going to see them in Jackson, Mississippi. Um, I think it's like May 5th, which is also Chris Brown's birthday. <laughs> so, yeah. Fact number 17. I don't like people staring at me. That is the weirdest thing ever. Like, I get people, you know, they see you and maybe they find you attractive or whatever. And, you know, you look and then you just look away. Okay, I don't need you staring me down half, like, for 10 minutes straight. I'm like, okay, you already got your look. Can you, can you look at something else now? Because, uh, eh. It's just it's very uncomfortable, and I don't like it. Fact number 18, I prefer CDs over streaming services. Like, I am currently not, well, I'm an Amazon Prime member, and they offer, like, streaming and whatnot. And I have... Uh, a few CDs that I actually downloaded from, you know, uh, from Amazon that I bought, like Eric Bellinger's Easy Call, which is a great, great album, by the way, and Drake's um, Scorpion, also a great album. I really liked it, and you know, a couple others, but I really like the hard copy CDs. Call me old school, I guess, but you know, that's just what I like. Fact number 19, I like certain Netflix series, like um, uh, original series, I'm sorry. On my blog, you, 13 Reasons, I really like those, those are like super entertaining. <laughs> and once you watch one episode, it's hard to not, um, it's hard to not watch the rest. Fact number 20, I don't like when people act like they're too good for for you or just for, for anybody. If they if they come off as too bougie or they feel like they just, you're either too bougie or you just feel like you know it all. Like, mm, I don't like people like that. Mm -mm. Fact number 21, I really want to learn how to type like 75 words per minute and then eventually move to like 100 words per minute like I know that's not the fastest people can type like people type 150 words per minute and stuff like that but you know uh, between 75 and 100 that's pretty good so I would really love to learn how to type really fast <laughs> Fact number 22, I love listening to motivational speakers such as Inky Johnson and E.T. the Hip Hop Preacher, my favorite two of all time, besides Les Brown, you know, I love him, absolutely, because he's pretty much the person who kind of got me into um, listening to other motivational speakers. Um, what is... Ah, Tony Robbins, also a very, very good motivational speaker. Fact number 23, I want to become super flexible. Yes, I don't want to be all rigid and by the time I get old, I'm all brittle and can't move and I'm stiff. And, ugh, no, so like I, I'm starting to stretch more now, you know, and hopefully, you know, I, will, I, will, I always wanted to learn how to do like, um, what is this split? Not the sideways split, but like um, the split down the middle, middle split. Maybe that's what they call it. I don't know. I, you know, I want to do stuff like that. And, you know, put my foot behind my head like I used to when I was a child. You know, fun stuff, fun stuff, you know. Fact number 24, I was a cheerleader in the seventh grade. And in the eighth grade, I ran track, track. 
and I wish I would have kept going with track. Um, I really like to run and just be active and whatnot. So I wish I would have just listened to my parents and my coach when they said, you know, um, no, you should keep doing track. And, you know, yeah, I was like, no, nah, I don't want to do that. Like, you know, just a stubborn child. But now I wish I would have, you know, I would have stuck with that. I feel like I would have been in better shape than I am now. Not to say, like, I'm just super morbidly obese or anything. I'm not. But, you know, I am currently working on my body to get it to look like um, what I want it to look basically like I would like to look like Tiana Taylor or something you know the body shape you know fact number 25 I really like dry seaweed seaweed is one has become one of my favorite foods I should have listed that when I was talking about avocados and whatnot yeah but yeah I really love seaweed fact number 26 I plan on um owning homes in like tropical areas like the Bahamas and you know just warmer areas like um West Africa, South Africa, Miami, the Honduras, places like that. Like I plan on like you know just owning homes in different parts of the world. So yeah. Fact number 27 my favorite vehicle of all time is a Range Rover. I really like the way the Range Rover is shaped. Okay, it's almost like this boxy shoe, but not quite a boxy shoe, like the newer versions. You know, I like the old versions too, it really doesn't matter. But I really like the way the Range Rovers are shaped. So, fact number 28, I really love Halloween. I really enjoy that that um that holiday for whatever reason. I really like scary movies and whatnot. I don't understand. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm not sure why, but Halloween is my favorite holiday. Fact um, 30. I hate cold weather. And I love the summertime and the springtime and fall. Basically every other season except winter. Number 31. I love science. Like astrology, astronomy, biology, anything having to do with science. I, I love it. Fact number 32, I want to learn how to basic cornrow. I always wanted to learn how to braid hair to the scalp. I like I'm okay at it, but I can be better and I just need to practice it more. Fact number 33, I really want to acquire a Wacom Cintiq. 27 touch HD or maybe the the new one they get out too but you know just one of them you know I would love to have that like right now like I love Wacom um, products I have I'm currently working on a tablet um, in this video as you can see I really love working on um, the tablet but I really want to send it I really want to know what they like out you know um, that's number 34. I plan on mastering all my foundations, um, foundation arts, like gesture drawing, figure drawing, value, you know, the works, basically. I want to become a master of the foundation, like perspective and whatnot. And I want to get, get like really good, like James Jean or Kim jong Gi, And yeah. And I want to master like watercolor painting as well. I want to master animation, just master just every form of art that I like to do, graphic design and you know, whatnot. Back number 35, if I could have one superpower, I would wish for the power of flight. 36, I am working on getting my confidence up because my confidence levels, I mean, they're somewhat up, they're better than what they used to be, but I still need to work on, you know, getting better at, you know, <laughs> at that. Number 37, I hate public speaking. I don't like the sound of my voice. It's just kind of irritating and weird. I'm like, that's how I sound. Like, even recording this, like, ugh, God. But, you know, I'm trying to work on that. Um, fact number 39, my favorite artists of all time are Kim jong Gi, James Jean, Norman Rockwell, and Kahindi Wiley. 
number 40 I love mystery books and movies and scary books and <laughs> movies like horror and mystery are my top two favorite genres of all time I want to thank everyone for watching please like comment subscribe and share and I will see you in the next video bye